name's uh, Joshua Ashcraft. I'm uh, from Louisville, Kentucky. I grew up a fan of Ohio Valley Wrestling, and now I <laughs> take pride in being the most hated man in Ohio Valley Wrestling. I was, uh, I was watching ECW, uh, and I, it had gone off. I started changing channels, and all of a sudden I came across wrestling, but it didn't look like anything I'd ever seen before. It was right as OVW had just signed their developmental contract with WWE. So I was seeing people like Randy Orton, John Cena, Brock Lesnar, Batista, all those guys here in OVW as they were just really starting to kind of cut their teeth in the business and I fell in love. Uh, February 19th of 2011 was the first show I ever did with OVW because we decided to, uh, to partner up with Kevin Thorne who was seven in OVW. They were doing a benefit show up in Indiana for the people that had died at the Sugarland concert when the storms came through. And our referee got stuck in traffic on the way to Indianapolis. And we already pushed bell time, pushed bell time, pushed bell time, and finally Paradise, uh, James Long, who is a very, very good friend of mine, um, came up to me and goes, you have dress pants, right? Yeah. I said, all right, well, cool, you're wearing an OVW shirt. Uh, go be a referee. I went out there and First match, split my pants in the crotch just a little bit, but nothing horrible. I thought, okay, well, I, I made it through that. You know, okay, let's go to the next one. It's a tag team match. I split my pants from my dick to my knee. As a manager, as a heel ref, as any of that stuff, you know, the, the most important part is what the boys are doing. My job is to get heat for my guys. It's not about me. They're the main course. I'm the, the side. You know, I'm there to compliment whatever is going on. And a lot of people don't realize that. I've wanted to be a heel pro wrestling manager for my entire life. That's the only thing I've ever wanted to do. Uh, I actually got in telecommunications when I was in high school so that I would be more comfortable speaking in front of a camera, speaking in front of people, you know, blocking out, things like that. You know, our slogan's always been tomorrow's superstars today. That's been our thing. We are a school, we are a training facility. We just happen to be one that is well-rooted. Um, we have a lot of ties to the community. We do fundraising shows, you know, we do the Kentucky Derby Festival uh, every year for the last few years. It's the fact that a lot of these people that come to the shows, and I was one of them, we're family. No matter what happens, we're always here for each other. No matter what's going on in your personal life, you know that you can step away for a couple hours every Wednesday, the first Saturday of every month, or even you know our spot shows, and be able to be around like-minded people. No matter what happens to me for the rest of my life, no matter where I go, no matter what I do, my name will be in the history books attached to Ohio Valley Wrestling, and I've left a legacy.